Hello guys, welcome to Solving Solutions, your number one channel where you get solutions to all your solving problems. It's nice having you in class again today. How have you been? We are going to show you how you can download them. Um, GGIS plugins and upload or let's say yeah, install it on GGIS. Maybe someone would have just shared it with you. You did not download it yourself or something like that, right? Good. And then you want to install that particular plugin or those plugins. So we are going to show you how you can do that. We want to add as um, what should I call it? We want to add as a bonus, you call it a bonus. We just want to add this part of the video which shows you how you can download from the um, plugins, the QGIS plugins website, right? Good. So we we'll download a plugin from here, we we'll see that zip file, and we we'll now go to QGIS and we we'll install it. So the process is the same if someone else sends you the zip file. So thanks for coming to class. If you're coming to the channel for the first time, you can encourage us by subscribing and if you're a returning viewer, thanks for always checking up on us. So this is actually the link pluginsm.mqjs.org slash plugins, right? Good. So when you come to this particular MQJS Python plugins repository, you will see different plugins. We have a maybe 1703 results found or yeah, the results, yeah, records found. So you see different tabs, featured, all stable new plugins of the so you see different, yeah, different tabs where you can maybe search for the plugin you're looking for. However, you can just use what this um, beautiful um, search icon. So let's just um, type for let's let's search for let's search for Google Earth Engine, right? Good. Let's search for Google Earth Engine. This should be Earth, then this should be Engine, right? Good. Now let's search for Google Earth Engine. So we'll download um, the the file, the zip file, then we are going to install it on QGIS. So if there are multiple results, you see the multiple results under your search results. If it's only one, you just see one. Let's just click on this um, Google Earth engine, right? Good. So this is it. Download latest Google Earth engine. That's the about, and this is the detail about, okay, the auto, the maintainer, different tags, and which you can still see on QGIS. Now we have the versions and the rest of that. And another reason why you might want to come to this um, their website to download is maybe if your Python repository or let's say your QGIS repository on um, QGIS is having some issues, you are unable to connect to the internet, right? Good. You're unable to go online if you're just having some issues. So you can just come down here if you know the name of the, of the plugin. You can just come down here, type it, and then you download and you go there and you install as a zip file. So we have seen what we are looking for. We just click on what to download. Good. So you can see the process has started and we are going to move it from downloads to our preferred folder. And from that folder, we are now going to move it to, what? to QGIS. Good. So we've actually uh, downloaded the Google Earth Engine plugin and we want to install it um, as a zip file so you know the drill you go to plugins then you click on manage and install plugins right good all right now when the plugins window is open you come down to install from zip install from zip so let's say by the time you come under your plugins you are unable to um, connect to the um, the online repository as we stated earlier you can just go to their browser to their website rather and then download the, the plugin and come down to install from zip right under install from zip you see if you are provided with a zip package containing a plugin to install please select the file below and click the install plugin button which is this right please note for most users this function is not applicable as the preferable way to install plugins as the preferable way is to install plugins from a repository which we told you that if it's not possible right good so let's now search for that um, zip file so you go to browse 
node. So we've actually moved it to a folder called plugins from zip and this is the earth engine plugin. Either we double click on it or we click on it and what select open, right? Good. Now you can see the install plugin highlighted. So we just click on the install plugin. Security warning: Installing a plugin from a trusted source can harm your computer. Actually, it was from a trusted source, but you just want to be careful, right? Good. So we just click on yes. Good. You can see plugin installed successfully, right? So since um, it has been installed, we can now move to installed. So check it out which is the um, google earth engine right good you can see google earth engine and it has been installed so this is how you go to the qgis repository let's say via their website download um, a plugin and then install the plugin uh, via install from zip on your qgis right and if someone also sent it to you and you're very sure of the source, you can still follow the same procedure to install the plugin on your QGIS. So, thanks for coming to class. We hope we've been able to provide solutions to this particular GIS problem. And we hope that you like this video. If you do, please don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't and share with your friends. And also don't forget to support the channel. We are going to see you on our next video. Until then, keep being good at what you're doing and have a very good time. Bye.